I'm Wesley Butler with Transsoft Solutions. Welcome to our how-to videos for ParkCab. Custom parking standards can be created under Design Parameters and Parking Standards. To do this, select New. Enter a new name, then select either Create New Standard to create an entirely new standard, or copy and modify existing standard to use an existing one and make modifications. When doing this, the original will not be changed. For our first example, we are copying the ITE guidelines. Creating a new standard starts a series of steps. There can be one or more parking sizes. Parking class refers to the level of service or turnover classifications. Select which angles are allowed and choose the units. This information is used to generate a table. The table can be edited and any items highlighted red are blank values which must be filled in. The graphic explains the various dimensions. In our second example, we are making a new parking standard from a blank template. We are creating a parking standard for parallel parking with a large and small size. A larger size of parallel parking stalls may be useful in cases where one side is facing an obstruction. In our example, we are only entering one parking class, calling it A, and 90 degrees to the aisle. In the table that has been generated, there are two columns. We need to enter a width and length for each. For typical parking stalls, the length is the larger dimension, the width the narrower. However, for creating parallel parking in this manner, these are reversed. The width along the aisle is longer, the depth is narrower. There are two additional numbers each that need to be entered. An aisle width for one-way traffic, and an aisle width for two-way traffic. These may be the same, higher number, or different numbers. In ParkCAD, all the other geometry for parking is derived from stall length, width, aisle width, and angle, and the rest of this table will fill itself in once these values are provided. The graphic at the side explains the meaning of all these dimensions. Once we have created our custom standard, by either method, it is a good practice to test it and measure the various stalls. Custom standards created in ParkCAD are files stored on the hard drive, which can be sent to other ParkCAD users and applied to different projects. Users can create standards for different jurisdictions, such as local governments, or design standards for specialized applications, such as truck or recreation vehicle parking. Thank you.